Astronomy is the branch of science that deals with celestial objects, space and the physical universe as a whole. For thousands of years, people have sought to understand space and the Earth's position in it. Until the 16th century, models of the universe always showed the Earth at the center, with the Sun and other planets revolving around it. In 1543, Nicholas Copernicus published his theory that the Sun was at the center and the planets revolved around it in perfect circles. People refused to accept this theory even after Galileo confirmed it in 1609. It was much later that Johannes Kepler suggested what we believe to be true today. That the planets do not move in perfect circles but in ellipses around the Sun. Saturn, Jupiter, Mars, Venus and Mercury were the only planets visible to the naked eye. Space First, man invented the aeroplane because he wanted to fly like the birds. But then he wasn't satisfied with that. He wanted to explore the sky, reach the moon and find out about the other planets too. In order to achieve this, he had to travel into space. Near the Earth's surface, there is plenty of air. This is what we call the Earth's atmosphere. As we go up, both the temperature and the pressure decrease. At the top of Mount Everest, which is five and a half miles above sea level, the air gets so thin that mountaineers carry oxygen to help them breathe. Then there comes a point when there is no air. It fades into nothing. This is where space begins. Space begins where the Earth's atmosphere ends. Space begins at about 160 kilometers above the Earth and cannot be reached by aircraft. The biggest problem to go into space is gravity. The Earth pulls every object towards it with a force. This force is called the gravitational force. For several years, scientists tried but could not overcome the force of gravity. Finally, they were able to design rockets which helped overcome the force of gravity and man successfully embarked on his journey into space. There is zero gravity in space. Everything floats there including astronauts and food.